Welcome friends. Let us solve the example number 14 of chapter 4 and the question says find the roots of the following equations. Actually this example has two parts and these equations are not in a standard form of a quadratic equation. First of all we shall change these equations into standard form of a quadratic equation. So let us start with part 1. In part 1 we are given I, an equation that is x plus 1 over x equals to 3 for all x is not equals to 0. It is given us that x is not equals to 0. And uh, now we shall multiply both the sides by x then we have x square plus 1 equals to 3x. This means x square minus 3x plus 1 is equals to 0. And now we shall apply the quadratic formula to find the value of this quadratic equation. For that we shall collect the coefficient of x square, coefficient of x and the constant term. Now we shall find the discriminant that is b square minus 4ac. Here we have minus 3 square minus 4 into 1 into 1. Here we have 9 minus 4, this means 5. And since D is greater than 0, therefore the roots are real and distinct. and now we shall apply the quadratic formula that is x equals to minus b plus minus uh, root d over 2a that is minus into minus 3 plus minus root 5 over 2 into 1 this means 3 plus minus square root of 5 over 2 so these are the two roots of the quadratic equation so this is the solution of the first part of the example and now we shall move to the second part that is 1 over x minus 1 over x minus 2 equals to 3 and now we shall take LCM of the left hand side that will be x into x minus 2 and if we divide x into x minus 2 by x then we have x minus 2 if we divide x into x minus 2 by x minus 2 then we have minus x here we have 3 over 1 we can cancel out this positive x with this negative x then we have minus 2 over x into x minus 2 equals to 3 over 1 and now we shall cross multiply this equation and for that then we have 3x into x minus 2 into minus 2 is equals to minus 2. If we multiply this value then we have 3x square minus 6x plus 2 equals to 0. We bring this minus 2 in the left hand side. And now we shall apply the quadratic formula for that we shall pick the coefficient of x square that is 3 coefficient of x that is minus 6 and the constant term that is positive 2. Now we shall find the discriminant that is d equals to b square minus 4ac and b is minus 6 minus 4 into 3 into 2. Here is 36 here is 24 this is equals to 12 d is 12 if we calculate a square root of d that is equals to plus minus 2 root 3 and since d is greater than 0 therefore roots are real and distinct And now we shall find the root that will that is x equals to minus b plus minus root d over 2a. Here we have minus b. B is 
minus 6 square root of d is 2 root 3 and 2 into a, a is 3 if we further solve this value then we have 6 plus minus 2 root 3 over 2 into 3 we can take 2 common from the numerator then it is equals to 3 plus minus root 3 over 2 into 3 we can cancel out 2 from both numerator and denominator this means we have 3 plus minus square root of 3 over 3 so these are the two zeros uh, two roots of the quad given quadratic equation so this is the solution of whole example thank you